Hello and welcome everybody, this is Alan Herdemian, a.k.a. the Fire Puller himself, a.k.a. the Fire Spitter, the Fire Smoker, and everything in between. Coming to you here live from Vegas, baby, Vegas. It is about 3 o'clock my time, that is about 6 o'clock Eastern time, and somewhere in between, well, it's somewhere in between. But we are about to get started with our fifth half-case player break. For Bowman Draft, Bowman Draft is flying off the shelves. If they're even on the shelves, price is going up every single day. Values unlike any other Bowman I've ever seen. This is the first time ever. Bowman products are going up as far as the singles go over time. Usually, they go down. Then they go back up, but... It's usually start high, drop down, go back up, but that takes years. Somehow, these cards are going up in value every single day. So, I'm glad to have a piece of some Bowman Draft for all you guys to break open. Hopefully, we can keep the streak of fire alive. Just going to wait a little bit more, see uh, when we get these people on here. So, right now, we got two. Not sure where everybody's at, but hopefully, we get some more people to join on in. And watch this break. If somebody can drop me a comment when they get in. Just want to make sure our comments are working. I'm going to get started on opening up our boxes. And then I'll let one of you guys shoot which boxes we are going to rip. So, we've got eight stacks of high society. Each box that we get out of here is going to have three autos. So we're going to be breaking four of these boxes today. The other four we're going to be busting open tomorrow. So that means, if I could get this motherfucker out, come on. There we go. That means we got 12 autos coming today, 12 autos coming tomorrow. Looking for a lot of fire. And it looks like our comments are working. Thanks for the assistance. Got boxes and boxes all over the place. Man, got to do some organizing. But there we go. So, first order of business. Somebody, tell me what we're breaking. We're either breaking the left side, the right side, the top half, or the bottom half. You like that? I'm Jewish too, so go figure. <laughs> Left side, strong side, baby. So these boxes, we're going to go, we're going to number them two, two, two. So that is the second half. So when you guys come back tomorrow and you see these boxes pop, you'll see those number twos to know that we keep it honest with the fire puller. So now that we've gotten that order of business out of the way, let me go with a couple and Mr. Rosen trying to get difficult on me, throwing shit, out, throwing shit out of order. Luckily, somebody saved me before he got to me. But got a couple disclaimers for all my newbies to the fire puller. Number one, we like to have fun in here. That is the number one rule because there is no rules. But because of that, these videos are rated R for adult language and adult humor. If you guys have kids in the room, please clear them out. If you can't clear them out, please lower the volume. If you can't do either or... Get off the video. At the end of the video, there will be a recap in the last uh, minute or two. So you will be able to see everything that you missed if you don't want to hear all the fun that we have. So now that we've covered that, that is one order of business. The other disclaimer is I do reside in the state of Nevada where it is legal for the recreational use of certain pharmaceuticals like marijuana. So you may see the occasional trip to what I call the fire torch during our break. It is allowed, and if you're a hater, please do the same as I told for the people with the little kids. Wait till the end of the break to watch the recap. Don't go bashing somebody's feedback because of their uh, prerogatives and abilities and rights as a human being. So, that being said, we've gotten out the negatives. We will have some positives. So, on the other side of this camera, you'll see our four boxes. You'll also see, well, four piles today. That's a bonus pile for our eBay unpaid and unclaimed mini. 
But those are the three piles for you guys. What that is is trivia giveaways. So I'm going to ask three trivias during the break. The way trivia works, you must spell correctly. I'm, let, me, let me fucking emphasize that. You must spell correctly. If you don't spell it correctly, you are not going to win. I will give you a trivia question. You will give me an answer. Your first answer is the only one that counts. So if it's wrong, if it's fat-fingered, if it's auto-corrected, does not fucking matter, you will not fucking win. Boom. So now that we've got that out of the way, the other part of the trivia, if you win a trivia question, you can answer all the other trivia questions, but you will not be a qualified answer because it's one prize per break member. You must be vested in the break to win the prize is the last disclaimer. So now, yes, Joey, uh, after this, I'm going to cut the video. Then we're going to do my mom's birthday celebration. God rest her soul. Uh, we're going to do that break. And right after that break on the same exact video, we're going to cut into the hoops uh, divisional. So we will do all that after this eBay break, but we're doing eBay right now. So now I've covered all of that good stuff. The only thing left is fire. I hope you guys are ready. I'm ready. I don't know about you, but I'm ready. But here we go. In customary fire puller fashion, we're going to light this fire now and hopefully it never burns out. So from my house to your house, this bud's for you. One call for good luck. <coughs> Mr. Rosen is in the building. <coughs> Ready to get this fire lit. <coughs> Woo! So, <coughs> we've got four boxes. No paper ships on the Bowman Draft. If you are looking for the paper, unfortunately, I am not one of those breakers that breaks 100,000 cases and has a billion dollars to uh, <coughs> justify selling the paper. I do not have the ability to sell the paper, so please do not reach out asking if I will sell it. There are too many people that do. I don't want to choose one over the other, and I also don't want to choose uh, selling it now over selling it later. Um, that being said, if you are not familiar with the fire puller, I am just like you. I am a collector. I am a breaker. I buy into more breaks than most people. Um, I do collect. And I do not run a shop nor have allocations. So I pay the same price as you guys pay for these breaks or for these cases. I just try to have some fun with other people rather than uh, shelling, all out, shelling all the money out myself to win or lose myself. I like sharing the wins and sharing the losses. You know what I mean? Helps my pocket and helps keep me uh, together with my baby. But that's that. We've got some fire coming. We're going to get started with trivia question number one. Of course, Fire Puller was prepper, prepping everything for today. He forgot the most important part, which was the trivia question. So we're going to go off the top of my head. If you are an eBay regular, and you will know you're a regular. Not an eBay regular, sorry. A Facebook regular. If you are one of my Facebook regulars, you are not qualified to play in these trivia questions. This is more for my newbies that may be on Facebook, but more so from eBay. So please do not ruin it, especially when you know the answers, because I've already done these in the room. So the first trivia question. I want to know the team who for more than half of their existence played all of their baseball games during the day. All of their home games, sorry, during the day. What baseball team played more than half of their existences home games during the day? That, Mr. Brent Allen, my man, you are number one on my feed. Boom. Zach, you got the right answer, but you're just a little slow. We got we to gotta boost that internet somehow. But <laughs> everybody's getting it right. There you go. I like, I like when I got some trivia guys in here. So 
Mr. Brent, you can answer. Of course you know, Jeremiah. Stop. But you just won't win. But here we go. Let me mark down because I got to get a sheet for my winners. Uh, who was my first winner? That was Brent. Brent, do me a favor. I need to know uh, a number, one, two, or three, and a player you have in the break. One, two, or three, and a player you have in the break. <laughs> you might have my old internet connection, uh, Chris. Number two and Mr. Howard. Oh, look at you. Got my boy Ed Howard. Congrats on winning that spot. Let's see if we can pop some Eddie. Eddie boy. All right, so here we go. We go through the paper quick. We're only looking at the bottom paper for some uh, parallels. But nothing. We got two refractors. Now, just so you guys know the way I do things, all your refractors are going to get penny sleeved. Your base guys of uh, most of the rook, uh, first Bowmans are going to get penny sleeved. Uh, half of them will get top loaded. But you will never have any refractor not protected. And if you don't know the value of Bowman, make sure you protect your refractors like they're your babies. But Nick Lofton and O'Neill Cruz, nice start. Nothing cooking here. We got some inserts. But we're looking for some fire here. So let me get my piles straightened out. There we go. So we will have trivia question number two at the halfway point. So at the halfway point, after box two, we'll do trivia question number two. But next stack, there's our parallel. Going to one of my biggest stashes right here, Francisco, as I call him, fuck you, fire puller Alvarez, because every time I broke Bowman Chrome, I broke the Mets. I got one freaking auto out of 13 cases. He is fuck you, fire puller Alvarez. But Jesse Franklin... And Swaggy T on that shit. Nothing cooking. We got a curse, Dad. These guys will get top-loaded. So if I put it to the left, it's getting top-loaded. Nothing cooking. We got some paper. Paper, paper. And what's going on, Mr. Cotabayo? Welcome to the party. Welcome to the show. Another one of my favorites right there, Gilberto Jimenez, Marco Luciano, two studs that we will see real soon. Looking for some torque. We got Mr. Veen, Mr. Veen. Another stud. And we got some paper. Moving on, we've got Rutherford and Jesse Franklin on the refractor. Nothing cooking here. We got a little Nick York, Tanner Burns, Hans Cruz, and our first auto, Big Boom, to kick us off. Carson Tucker, Refractor, out of $4.99. Boom. Congrats to the Carson Tucker spot. That's a good way to kick it off. We want, we want TLC in this fucking break. No, scrubs, no, no. <laughs> Just got some paper bullshit. Then we got some more paper bullshit. Our refractors, Jordan Blumovich. Then we got Nikki G. Big boom. Nice hit for that spot. Nothing cooking here. Nothing cooking. Little Xavier Warren. And then we are gonna get to some paper, but we got some green. Andrew Vaughn, boom. Nice hit to his spot. This is going to be your money maker. If you guys got Vaughns at the house, start fucking framing them. It's your money maker right there. Shake your money maker. <laughs> and we got Joe Ryan on the refractor. Blake Rutherford stealing the refractor. Mitchell Parker, nothing cooking, nothing cooking, nothing cooking. And we got Sky Blue, Christian Chamberlain. And then Riley Green on the insert. Bear with me one second. I haven't broken uh, Bowman Draft in a while, but I need my 
paper box. All right, we are good to go. And here we go with the next stack. Good luck to you guys. We got some paper. Refractor, Jackson Miller. Jackson Rutledge right behind it. Nothing cooking. There's a Soderstrom. Nice hit right there. Case Williams, Bryce Jarvis. And we're going to get to our hot spot, so let's put paper on top. Paper, paper, paper. And a Martian Refractor. Boom! Centering looks like shit, but it's still a Martian Refractor. Put that in the stash box. Reed Detmers. And we got nothing cooking. Our next auto, Justin Fosk at a 250. Boom. Nice hit. Got a couple guys in my room that drool over this guy. And I will be honest, he is on my stash. He's one of my miniature targets. Nice hit right there. Now, just to pop up with this for those new to the way I break. Um, these cards come probably about two or three per case. The way I do it, I don't random them. I just give them the odd number goes to the more expensive guy on the card. The even number goes to the less expensive guy. That way, in most situations, everybody's getting at least one and you're not like out if you are a collector, building sets, etc. Everything about the way I do it is just to try to be as fair to Fair to all as possible. Only time I will have to go to a random is if there's multiple players on the same card. That I won't do a dice roll. That I won't do uh, do the right thing or the more expensive thing. That is all your chance. Jackson Kovar, Bryce Jarvis on the refractors. Thanks for bearing with me on that. Carson Tucker. Uh, Justin Lang, Joe Doyle. Ronaldo Hernandez, nothing cooking. We got a little Ed Howard insert. We'd like to see a lot of Ed Howard ink. Fuck that insert bullshit. Nothing cooking in the paper. And we've got some colorful. Another Martian refractor. Boom. Two. Let's look at this one. This one might be, I don't know. Nope, they're both uh, fucking built like shit. But still... Two Martian refractors, and we're only on box one. That'll pretty much pay for the spot. And here we go. We, woo, we got another refractor that'll pay for the spot. Close to it. Sky Blue, Daniel Lynch. And what's going on, Mr. Hanson? Welcome to the party. Welcome to the show. We got PCA, baby. This is my man's in them. Number two on my list in the draft, ahead of Mr. Torkelson, and that was just some shit from the cards. You are clean. Well, maybe, hold on. No, you're not clean. I saw the top right, but the bottom left, those are right where the uh, light is. Those are little dimples or whatever the hell they call them. Still a great hit, worth good money. It's just not going to get us a gem. But Austin Martin, PCA, Spencer Torkelson, Heston Kerstad. Those, that's my order. Fire puller, set it first. Nothing cooking. We got a Martian. And then we got some paper. Closing out box number one. We got a sparkle coming. Hopefully it's our auto. But Aaron Ashby, Liam Norris on the refractor. Nothing cooking. Alaric, 
Ah, uh, oh, you bum. Carter Bumler steals the sparkle. Brandon Fat, even worse. Either way, <laughs> fuck. Brandon smoked the fatty. At least it wasn't a Bumler fucking sparkle. No offense to whoever got the Bumler spot, but that is definitely not what we want to waste our sparkle on. Then we got some paper. Next up, box number two. Three more autos coming. Three more numbered cards. Hopefully a little bit of fire. And when we're talking about fire, we're talking about fire colors. That's gold, orange, red, and black. I'll even take that really, really gold shit that says one of one. Boom. We hit one on one of the first eBay breaks of this we did. Hit Daniel Cabrera, Super Auto Bowman first. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Rosen. <laughs> I hope you get some color, Bumbler. But I, I do have <laughs> I do have certain guidelines, even when I get the value spot. Like I feel bad when I hit a red in a break on like fucking <laughs> Who did I hit? Uh what was it? I had the White Sox, so I hit uh Zach Collins red. Like, you know there's only one red in the case. If I'm in the case, the last red I want to see is Zach Collins, even when I have the spot. Like, I want to see the big guns. I want to be like, you know what? I was a part of that break. This dude hit, like, a red Torkelson. Fucking $50,000 sold for the next day. I wish I, I bought that spot. <laughs> then you got the guys that keep buying the spot thinking they're going to hit it. And you see them in the streets like, man, I thought I was going to hit it. <laughs> oh, no, I'm just having fun, Mr. Rosen. And I appreciate you under <laughs> understanding and having fun with us. But here we go. Box number two coming right up. We've got some paper. We got Libby. Mr. Cotton. Nothing cooking. Jared Jones. Some inserts. We got some paper. Sammy Infante. One of my sleepers. Kyle Isbell right there. Seminary. Nothing cooking. We need bigums. How's about some Nwogu? And we got a blue auto coming. No, we don't. I lied. <laughs> Jackson Kovar, Sky Blue, and Adam Seminary. Blue at a 150. See, these I don't mind. You take all the color you want. Non-auto. Just don't steal that auto. <laughs> Next up, we got some paper. D.L. Hall at a four ninety nine, and we got Mr. Burleson on the refractor. J.J. Blood Day, Casey Martin, Bishop, Austin Hendrick. Bailey Horn, Caraway, the Loach, the P Rats. We got some paper. And our hit is coming. Josh Jung, Sammy Infante again on the refractor. Nothing cooking. Nothing cooking. Our boom. 
Mr. Barnhart, nice hit for the Rays at a 4.99. Mr. Meyer right behind it. And what's going on, Brian? Welcome to the party. Welcome to the show. We got some more paper bullshit. Stack number two. Paper. Luciano again on the refractor. Tacoa Roby. We're looking for it. We're looking for it, Brady. Mr. Calabrese. Nothing cooking. And we got some paper. Some paper. We got, I've got hoes. I've got hoes. Nothing cooking. Looking for some big names. Where are the big names? Nothing. We need some more firsts. Mr. Infante, Quentin Tarantino, nothing. We got some paper. And there is our auto. Woo! Joey Cantillo, Cody Hose on the refractor, Connor Phillips, Volpe, Pokebitch, Andrew Vaughn, Gage Workman, Daniel Cabrera, and Mr. Veen, Mr. Veen. I said on the Cabrera, but I did see a line at a glance. There it is. Right on the left side, but nice auto nonetheless. And we got some paper. Last stack of box number two. Nothing cooking. We've got Mr. Rutledge and Gilberto Jimenez on the refractor. Mr. Asa Basie finally sees some of him. Nothing cooking. Another Asa Basie. We got some paper. And we got Mr. Barnhart on the refractor. Joey Cantillo on the refractor. Nothing cooking. Austin Hendrick again. Nice hit for that spot. And Daniel Espino gets the sky blue. Boom. And we got paper, and we got some orange paper coming up. Good luck to you guys. Is going to Nick Lofton. Boom. Nice hit. Boom. I love me some orange. Right behind that, we got Kyle Nicholas on the refractor. J.J. Goss, nothing cooking. We got a PCA in the building. Nothing. And Nikki G on the insert. Get rid of some paper. Got our hit coming. Here we go. Good luck to everybody. We got a purple haze. I don't know if it's color or auto. But we're going to find out. Paper, 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 paper. Ronaldo, Hunter Barnhart. Oh, everybody's waiting. Like, Give me that perp. Give me that perp. Nikki G. Oh, we got back-to-back -back perps. So we got color and we got auto. Purple haze, Justin Fosk. Boom. And Tanner Burns at a 250. Nice hit to whoever got Tanner Burns. He is a tough hit from what I've broken. And he is one of my pitchers high on the list. Boom.
Very nice. And then we got some paper. And that, my friends, is box number two. We're going to be on to box number three in a second. And we are going to have trivia question number two right now. So just a reminder for all my eBay regulars, please do not answer the trivia questions because they are repeats due to forgetting to set up the trivia today. So I don't want uh, you guys ruin it for the eBay people. So what we've got for trivia question number two. Trivia question number two. Ooh, I got to think about this one. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right. Let's go. Hmm. I want to know the years. The years that the Yankees won four World Series championships in a row. The years. You can give me a line starting with the first, going to the last. You can write them all out. You can write them in, but you must write them in with 19 in the beginning. Got to spend that extra half a second to type in the actual year. Ooh. Ooh, we got, we got some answers. We got some answers in there. We did not have correct answers. But we did have answers, and amidst those answers, one of them was correct. Mr. Hodgin, my man's in him, my new man's in him. Mr. Hodgin, you are my winner. Mr. McComb, even if you got the fucking thing right, I still would have said you, you were wrong. So fuck you. No. <laughs> Mr. Hodgin. Let me know one of the players you got in today's break and give me a number one or three, my friend. And fuck, <laughs> Mr. McComb put up five years. So, <laughs> <laughs> holy shit. I just looked at that. I'm like, this motherfucker. <laughs> C.J. Abrams. And what's going on, Adam? Welcome to the party. Welcome to the show. C.J. Abrams. And number three from my main man, Chris Hodgins. Holy shit. What are the years? Four years in a row. This motherfucker puts five years. Unbelievable. We going, we going back to school, Mr. McComb. We taking you back. Call me tomorrow morning for some lessons. Boom. Bryson Stott, Jackson Miller on the refractor. Nothing cooking. Drew Homo, Max Meyer finally makes an appearance. Nothing cooking. We got some Torkelson. And we got some paper. And we got Clayton beat her ass down. Then we got Ronaldo Hernandez. Bobby Miller taking in the tank. Mike Taglia. Carson Tucker again. And we got a sparkle. Nick, how low can you Lodolo? Boom. And we got some paper. We got some purple paper. Josh Young, baby. And we got some Hassle Refractor coming. Boom. Nice hit right there for the Hassle spot. Luciano. 
Oh, no, that was Hello Ramos. Justin Fosk. Little Jordan Westberg. Caden Polk the bitch. C.J. Abrams. Bedell. Mariners. Paper, 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 paper. <coughs> Nothing cooking there. Then we got Aaron Shortridge. Clayton beat her ass down. Jordan Nwogu. Hunter Bishop. RJ Dababich. Garrett Crockett. Dane Acker and Ian Seymour. Boom. Little cursed ad right behind it. Seymour makes the cut four ninety nine refractor. Stack number two. Here we go. We got some paper. Oswald Peraza on the refractor. PCA, another refractor, a lot cleaner than the last one. Just some dust. You are looking good, my friend. Looking good. We're going to get this under the scope in just a second. But whoever's got PCA, congrats to you. I think, I think we got you a 10. I'll give it a 10. You're good on the back. PSA, baby, all day. All day. All day. Nice hit right there. Whoop, wrong pile. But then we got Mr. McClanahan, Patrick Bailey, Bryce Jarvis, nothing cooking, a little Martian. Nothing. And then we got some paper. Next up, we've got Asa Basie. On the refractor. Ooh, we got a nice refractor coming. Ace of Basie right behind it. We got Mr. Shortridge. O'Neal Cruz. Blake Rutherford. Jesse Franklin. Trent Palmer. Austin Wells. Nick Kibbles and Bitsko. Sky Blue. J.J. Blade. And we got some paper. And our big refractor right here. It ain't torque. It ain't cursed that, but that's good. Get some ink with this card and we'll be sitting pretty. Nice hit for the Howard spot. Boom. Seymour Butts up. Oh, I don't think he's here. <laughs> See more butts here. <laughs> then we got Mr. Larnick. And then some Landon Knack. Werner Blakely. Nothing cooking. We got Emerson Hadcock. We got a Nikki G. Nothing cooking. We got some paper. And closing out stack number two. Paper, paper, paper. Xavier Edwards and Asa Basie on the refractor. Way off. Way off, but who the fuck cares? It's Asa Basie. He'll be a stud. Jordan Walker, another stud. Nice hit right there for the cards. Nothing cooking. And Evan Carter is our autograph. Boom. Nice hit for that spot. Next up, we've got some paper. Then we've got Hunter Bishop on the refractor. Austin Hendrick on the refractor. Nice hit. Centering looks good. Not so much on the back, but centering on the front's clean. Nothing cooking. Oh, I bet. 
I hit PCA on a personal box. Could not hit him for shit in any of the breaks. I literally, I had to stop breaking Bowman Draft altogether because I was chasing Kerstad and PCA, and I couldn't hit on any of them. I stack up all my uh, base and refractors, though, and that kind of helps me out. But I was like, man, I'm never going to hit them. So I bought a personal box for myself and ripped. I pulled a Sparkle uh, Hancock, uh, Blue Warren, and the last card was a Red Wave PCA. I was like, yep, I'm done with Bowman Draft. <laughs> K-Rob, my man. Then we got some paper. Blue coming. Hello, Ramos. How you doing? Out of $4.99. Wow. That's real strong on Hendrick. Yeah, and he, he's a tough pull. I don't think I've pulled more than one auto of him. And I broke in probably about 15 to 18 cases of this. But nothing cooking there. Closing out, we've got a nice insert. Whoop, I got it backwards. There we go. But we got some paper. And what's going on, Kevin? Welcome to the party. Welcome to the show. RJ Dababitch, another Crockett fucking refractor. Good shit to that spot. Nothing cooking. We got green coming. Heston Kerstad, but hold on. We got some gold coming right behind it. Oh, Kyle Nicholas. Boom. Numbered out of 50. Unbelievable. Green Kerstad out of 99. Number four. Boom. And gold Kyle Nicholas. Good hit for that spot. I believe he was an unclaimed or unpaid spot. Ah, see, Brady, you had Kyle Nicholas. And you know if you had Kyle Nicholas, I'm going to be trading for this bad boy. That's why I keep those brewers stashed away. For a rainy day. Nice hit right there, Brady. Good shit. Oh, that was Adley. Thank you. Good catch. I wasn't even looking. My bad. That is going to the Adley spot at a 99. I was so focused on the gold. I, I just love gold autos. So my apologies. But we are up to uh, box number th four. My bad. Box number four. And once we get to stack number two, I'm going to do trivia question number three. Yeah, I can't even say I've pulled a Jordan Walker. In Bowman Best, I pulled a couple, but I don't think I pulled any in this. Now, just a reminder for those of you that are watching this break, the second half of this break, auctions end tonight. So they will be going on. They should be starting to end in about three or four hours, somewhere around there. I don't even know. Somebody else does the listings for me, and he tells me what times they're running and what times I'm breaking, but I tell him, you got to message me the night before and the morning of. <laughs> You can tell me right now. If it's more than fucking 10 minutes from now, I'm not going to remember. I need an unread message to wake up to amongst the other hundred that I have to deal with. And Mr. Rubio is in the building. Welcome to the party. Welcome to the show. We are looking for a big boom to pop. We've got some decent array of color, decent array of names, but we have not had a big pop. Right? 
You ain't lying, Eric. You ain't lying. And Joseph, that is correct. We deal with that almost every day. I've had a few breaks where we had a clean payout. But I can tell you, I'd say a few breaks is exactly that. Like two or three out of easily a hundred that I've done. All the other ones are like, people don't respond, people don't don't reach out, they bid on them, you send them five emails, they don't respond to the emails, then they respond to the email and say, oh, I didn't know I had to pay. And it's like, you deal with all types of shit. The best one <laughs> was one guy bid <laughs> on like 30 spots and then emails me, it was a half case break, and he, he emails me, he's like, oh, I thought it was two cases. I said, <laughs> why? He's like, I saw the two in the title. I said, what about the one in the slash before it? <laughs> right? And Mr. Rosen, I don't. And I'll tell you why. When it comes to that stuff, it's hard for me to say what's going on, who's doing what. I throw it in the morning in the uh, group. So if you're ever in one of my eBay breaks and you are one of the bidders and you see that name pop up, in the mini or the unpaid spots, just message me and say, hey, I was one of the bidders on that item and that's how I do it. I'm not just gonna reach out to eBay people because then I'm waiting for responses. The whole thing is for me, I can't afford to lose on these spots or any of this stuff, so I gotta sell them right away. That's why there's always a morning uh, setup for all these breaks in the Facebook room. But Mr. Nwogu on the refractor, Nothing cooking behind that. Then we got some bullshit. But yeah, I literally, I gave that guy till <laughs> as long as I possibly could because I said, I don't want that spot going unpaid. That's the biggest spot in the break. I need, <laughs> I need that shit paid. But Jordan Westberg... Uh, sky blue, true blue, Corey Lee, a sleeper, sleeper for mo both of these guys are sleepers, but both very, very good players. Ones to watch out for. And thank you, Joseph. You'll find out the longer you get to know me, I try to do everything as fairly as possible. And I am the most impartial and anal judge there is especially outside of this hobby. <laughs> Ask my fiance. She hates her loving fiance, husband to be. That's her grandpa, as she says. But Tanner Burns out of 150. Boom. Following up, we got Zach Deloche. Then we got Adam went to the seminary. On the refractor, A.J. Bookabitch. Nothing cooking. We got some inserts. Nothing cooking. Whoop, give me one second, sorry. There we go. Ian Bedell, Bobby Miller, Julio Rodriguez, nothing cooking, and a blue wave, Logan Hoffman, boom, what about some P-Rat love, number nine out of 150, boom. And we got a Martian. We got some paper. On to stack number two. Trivia question number three coming. Trivia question number three coming. What is the name of the song they played 
at Yankee Stadium, the old Yankee Stadium, after every Yankee victory. I'd say for its last 10 years at least, because I could be wrong on how long, but we're going to say for the last 10 years at least. But Caden Pokovich on the refractor, nothing cooking. We got a Garrett Mitchell finally. Hallelujah. Nothing cooking. We got some paper. Paper, paper, paper. We are the champions, my friends. We we'll keep on fighting to the end. Mr. Jeffrey Letterer. Jeffrey Letterer, you are my first qualified answer. You will get pile number one. I just need to know a player you have in this break. Drew Homo and Ian Bedell on the refractor. Fucking finally, Brady. We got you a Torkelson. Horrible centering. Oh, you got jokes, Eric. That's all right. Someone find the mute button for that motherfucker. But anyway, continuing on, <laughs> Reese Hines, Logan Gilbert, Brandon Fat, Trey Cruz, take it in the tank, C.J. Abrams. And then we got some paper. And Sky Blue, O'Neal Cruz. Boom. You're all good, Mr. Cartabio. You know most people would ignore your answers anyway, thinking you were just a moron. So, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Jordan Adams, I love you, man. Nothing cooking. But, Mr. Jeffrey, I do still... Oh, Kaden Pokovich, now it came through. Sorry, there's all this shit happening. All these messages. So, we got one... Caden Pokovich. And that is Mr. Letterer. I'll be nice just this time, but you, you saw that I had to take your spot in basketball. <laughs> right? I had to take your spot in basketball, and you would have had the top spot. And I was like, man, I was going to tag you, and I was like, nope. I was like, I know. If I tag him, he's going to get that top. Oh. There it is, Carter Bummer. We got you back, brother. Boom. Sparkle and an auto. But I was like, man, if I, if I give it to him, he's going to get top spot, hit a Zion super, and then I'm going to kill myself tonight. So I was like, screw it. I'm just going to take Mr. Carter Bio's spot before I tag him. And boom. Top spot loving. So you know I'm going to strike out. <laughs> But last stack mojo. Good luck to you guys. Oh, yeah. No, <laughs> Mr. Rosen, off of eBay in Facebook uh, family. Yeah, there is no feeling sorry. We got one guy. I call him the candy man because he keeps taking my candy and everybody else is in the rooms. Every single mini, he gets that top spot. So his new name is the candy man. And we got nicknames for most of us. Like, they gave me the name Fire Puller. I wanted to be the collector for collectors, but they didn't like that. But here we go. We got some sky blue Carson Ragsdale. Let's leave that at the end. Let's wait for some real fire. Purple. Hunter Green. Out of 250. Nice hit for the Hunter Green spot. He'll be up very shortly. Yeah. <laughs> I wish I was that sharp. But here we go. <laughs> Tacoa Roby and Matthew Liberatori. That was actually Raul Viscara. He was the one that gave me the name. Justin Fosk makes an appearance. Tristan Kakos, Adley Rushman, not Heston Kerstad. And we got some paper. 
And our last hit is in this pile. So we're going to start here with some paper. We're going to go to Swaggy T. Landon Knack on the refractor. Mason Wynn. Max Meyer with an added bonus at the end. Canario. Hoffman. Slade. We got Purple Haze. And then the big boom. Boom. Sammy Infante. Nice way to end this break. Out of 99. We have only seen one gold auto. One orange paper. None of the big names. I'm excited for this second half. I'll tell you that much. I'll tell you that much. I think we are going to see some fireworks in that second half. And Mr. Infante, don't sleep on him. If he's that common, I'd want to have that spot because that boy is a nice addition to the Nationals team. And I think he'll be up a lot quicker than most people think. But here we go with our reveal. Our reveal, pile number one, going to Mr. Letterer and Caden Pokovich. We've got you. Jackson takes it in the coots. That is numbered out of 50. Jackson takes it in the coots auto and Alejandro Kirk out of 199. And that is a mega out of 199. Boom. So, poke a bitch. Just in case the kids are there, we'll just call it poke a bit. And then we got pile number two. Pile number two is going to Mr. Brent Allen and Ed Howard. We've got Dan Vogelbach on the cracked ice. We got Ian Seymour Butts. And then we got Josh Bell on the relic. Okay, next up, pile number three. This is going to C.J. Abrams and Mr. Hodgin. We got you, Mike Bowman from the Orioles, Kale Emshoff from the Royals, and you get the magic stick. Boom! Austin Martin on the relic. Nice hit right there, my friend. And then for Marsha, 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 Marsha. Well, hold on. Almost fucked everything up. My bad. But for Marsha, we did have our eBay unpaid and unclaimed mini. She was the lucky recipient of winning Kibbles and Bitsco. So the mystery prize is a PC pack. That is why I ask you guys for your uh, top three teams every so often. But Miss Marsha, this is heading to you just for participating in that mini. Bobby Miller on the silver. Uh, Jake Vogel, that is numbered out of 75. Topps Holiday, Gavin Lux rookie. Bowman Chrome, Gavin Lux rookie. Kiebert Ruiz, uh, 99 paper. And Drew Avons, Bowman Chrome Auto. Thank you, Miss Marsha. I appreciate you as always. That, my friends, is the break. Let's do a quick recap. We've got Infante out of 99, Jordan Blulovich, Carson Ragsdale, uh, Sky Blue, Hunter Green out of 250, Carter Bummer. You're very welcome, Marsha. Carter Bummer on the uh, base auto, O'Neill Cruz, 499 paper, Torque on the base. That just slipped in there. Logan Hoffman, Blue Wave out of 150. Tanner Burns, Blue Paper out of 150. Bowman Chrome, 150. Corey Lee, Jordan Westberg, Sky Blue, Beauty. Kyle Nicholas out of 50. Adley Rushman out of 99. Hello Ramos out of 499. Evan Carter, uh, Nick Kibbles and Bitsko, Sky Blue. Ed Howard on the refractor. Ian Seymour Butts out of 499 Auto, Josh Young 250 Paper, Nick Lodolo Sparkle, Tanner Burns Purple Auto out of 250, Justin Fosk Purple Chrome out of 250, Nick Lofton Orange Paper out of 25, uh, Daniel Espino Sky Blue. 
Then we got Daniel Cabrera, base auto. Hunter Barnhart, out of 499 auto. D.L. Hall, paper bullshit, out of 499. Jackson Kovar, sky blue. Adam went to the seminary, out of 150. Carter Bummer, sparkle. Brandon Fat, base auto. PCA, refractor. Daniel Lynch, uh, sky blue paper. Then we got Justin Fosk, insert auto, out of 250. Christian Chamberlain, sky blue. Andrew Vaughn, green paper out of 99. Carson Tucker, refractor auto out of 499. And Francisco, fuck you, fire puller Alvarez. Sky blue out of 499. That, my friends, is the break. I thank you guys for participating, watching, and enjoying the show. Yankees, the best team to ever do it. Derek G, the best player to ever play it. And the fire puller himself, the best breaker to ever break it. Peace and love. See you soon.